Okay, tell me who you are. Uh, my name is John Tran. I work at Alter G, the makers of the anti gravity treadmill. Okay, and what is your job there? What is your role? I do, I'm a field service technician, trainer, customer support, and I fly around the nation installing machines, fixing machines, and uh, making our clients happy. And this is the machine right behind us here? Yes, that's the machine. That's our small machine. And we have the performance machine, which we'll show you guys later. And what, is your, what does your average day look like? Uh, it's about, it can or, be... Or, or I'm sorry, tell me average week. Tell, walk me through the week. Um, I state hop from day to day. So I can start on the West Coast and then hop from state to state to the East Coast. Okay. Uh, sometimes five to six states in one, day, in one week. And then I'll be back in California by Friday night, Saturday morning. And sometimes fly out right, right at uh, you know, Sunday morning. Yeah, that's a busy week. And you're and you're so you're in your your specific role is you're both customer service. You're an engineer. You've 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 a little bit of MacGyver. We, yeah. we just say MacGyver because sometimes you feel like MacGyver um, because you know you got to get it done. You got to get to work, and you have the necessary training and background knowledge to go to Home Depot, go to Ace Hardware, go to wherever you need to do to get your machines up and running again. And make the customers happy. And you, um, and generally, you, you said you work quite a bit, right? Because you're on the road. You're on the road. Yeah. You know, ninety five percent of the month, you're you're outside of the Bay Area. Yeah. Um, what's you know what do you do? You know what do you do to stay sane when you're on the road that much? I mean, how do you how do you you know maintain everything and eat what, healthy? Yeah. You gotta eat healthy, and uh, what keeps me going is just meeting the people. Um, you know, I get to go. I visited. New England Patriots, I visited the Philadelphia Eagles, I visited the Chicago Bears, um, LA Clippers, um, you know, some celebrities' houses, and you know, you don't get that in a lot of jobs where you can meet all these cool people and, uh, and hang out with them for a day or two. And you know, they treat you like you're just a friend or just another person, and you get to see the background of how things are done without the posh and the and it's kind of nice to see them acting normally, you know, because they care about their health and they care about their well-being, and you know that's what that's why they they work out in this machine. It's you've nice been doing that. you've been doing this for four or five months, right? Four five months, yeah. And um, cool. And, and originally, you were actually you were going into healthcare. You were you were going to go to dental school or go to medical school. Yeah. And uh, you, you t tell me what what is your education background? You've got. Uh, I have a degree in biopsychology, and I have a master's degree in biology. And I have a computer networking hardware hobby background that I've been doing for about 12 years now. Okay. So for fun. And uh, any other advice to, uh, you know, I think this is the coolest, it's, this is the coolest customer service job you could possibly <laughs> have in the world. So how does somebody land a job like this and what advice do you have to people looking for? Uh, Stay open. You never know where things are going to take you. And you never, and be nice to everyone because you never know who you're going to meet that will open the door for you. And stay busy because, you know, when the medical stuff didn't work out or the dental stuff didn't work out, I was just devastated because you work so hard for that. But, you know, with a lot of help from friends and the people that I've met, you know, you stay busy and you build yourself back up again. And, and just be nice to the people around you because you never know where that helping hand is going to come. And I got that, you know, and it landed me here and I'm doing pretty well right now. I'm awesome. Very, very happy. Well, great to meet you. Thanks Thank for doing this. Okay.